by city is blessed with breathtaking display of the sea and vast sugarcane fields. But there's something even more special about Bais. Baisanans themselves. They never give up, no matter what challenge they face. And that makes Bais a place of beauty and resilience. This is Olympia, a small island in Bay City where people thrive on the simple real and the setting of the day's story of hope and inspiration. Join us as we take a look at little Anthony and how his family, despite the unfortunate circumstances that came their way, make the best out of life together. Olympia Island, the heart of Bay City, where hope, faith, and nature intertwine. In this journey, we will reveal the inspiring story of a family who faced hardships without any advantages, yet never lost their determination to survive and held onto their unwavering faith. How far can hope carry us when the odds are against us? Max Tulelis, a dedicated fisherman, rises with the sun each day, embarking on a challenging journey at sea. His catch determines the fate of his family's next meal. Max used to work in Manila back in 2004, until he had a stroke. A tumor was found in his brain. Though his employer offered to pay for his operation to take it out, Max feared for the complications that may leave his wife without a husband and his kids without a father. And so they returned to Barangay Olympia to live a simpler life. Annalisa, Max's wife, works as a seashore cleaner, making most of what the sea provides. Her tireless efforts help supplement their volatile income. Pag 
tabang inyong nadawat gikan sa mga tawo diri sa Olympia sa mga kapitan The Tolelis family were blessed with five beautiful children, two studying diligently, striving for a better future, and one with special needs. Their dreams are intertwined with the challenges they face daily. This is Anthony, Tulele's family's second born, and the only child out of five to be stricken with a horrible disease. Anthony was diagnosed with polio at an early age, hindering his ability to walk. And unfortunately to this day, there's no known cure for such disease. Anthony's day begins with his family's unwavering support as they create a nurturing environment tailored to his unique needs. Through patient guidance and specialized care, they empower him to embrace life's possibilities.
his journey is not without obstacles. The Tulelis family faces the daunting task of finding resources and support on their secluded island. Yet within these challenges lie moments of triumph, as Anthony defies expectations and reaches new milestones. from Polimgi Island at the Radio School. We have this um, inclusion in education. So this is education for all. So um, no uh, no child is behind. So in our child mapping, uh, we discovered that Anthony is not attending his school. So we initiated that we have to enroll him since um, he is 12 years old. So 12 years old is grade 6, but he's still not um, attending school. Well, since Anthony is EWD and he never attended school, so um, I discovered that he can't write, he can't read, so I'm still on his beginning uh, stage. So, a fashion ito nuan pa from uh, the basic, we have uh, how to write, so how to read, but um, he is uh, learning. During our sessions, he cooperates, but um, I must conclude that he's still an average uh, type of murderer. Their income solely relies on the unpredictability of the sea. If Max returns empty-handed, their dinner table remains bare. And if Maria fails to sell her catch, Survival becomes an uphill battle. I am the newly elected SK chairperson of Barangay Olympia. Daghan uh, ng mga tabang di patigayon para sa Tonalis family, especially ni Anthony, na usaka person with disability. Uh, earlier this month, the area of Philippine National Police or mag offer sa ilahon nga 13 days of Christmas, which ni hatag sila og mga hinabag mga relief goods para sa Tonelis family. And also last year, if I am not wrong, ni ayo pod ang Dollier family para ilang ipatigayon or ilang ni hatag ang osaka wheelchair nga mag, um, nakita ninyo kanina nga wheelchair nga gigamit ni Anthony.
Nevertheless, in the face of these obstacles, the Tolalis family discovers comfort and reassurance through the resilient connections nurtured within their community. The assistance and solidarity shown by the barangay officials had a positive impact, providing a source of strength and encouragement during the family's most difficult moments. The dreams Anthony hold are woven into the fabric of Tolelis family's hopes. They envision a world where Anthony's talents are celebrated, where he can contribute his unique gifts and be embraced for the extraordinary individual he is. The Tulalis family shows us how powerful hope can be, even when life is full of surprises. Their story reminds us of the strong influence of love, resilience, and the unbreakable connections that hold them together. They inspire us to embrace these qualities in our own lives. The story of Tolele's family would tell us quite a few things. One, life is all about ups and downs. And if you're unprepared, we'll catch you 
of God. Two, life will knock you down if you let it. Faith can be cruel sometimes, but we do what we must and push through. Finally, love and hope can conquer despair. Life can swing anything at you, but if you hold on to hope with love in your heart, you will prevail. And that, my friends, is the current of life.